Hello everyone, welcome to High School Mathematics channel. Today we are going to learn class 7, semester 2, chapter 3, algebraic expressions, exercise 3.3. See now first question, write standard form and additive inverse of the following expressions. See the first one, minus 6a. Its standard form is minus 6a only. Next, AT inverse of minus 6a is plus 6a. See now second one, 2 plus 7c square. Standard form is 7c square plus 2. In standard form, we have to arrange the given expression, exponents of the variables in descending order. So we have written here 7c square plus 2. See now a to inverse of 2 plus 7c square is plus 7c square means minus 7c square plus 2 means minus 2. Therefore, a to inverse is minus 7c square minus 2. See now third one. 6x square plus 4x minus 5. The given expression is the standard form only. So, we have written again same. 6x square plus 4x minus 5. a to inverse is minus 6x square minus 4x plus 5. See now fourth one. 3c plus 7a minus 9b. In this expression, all exponents are 1 only. So, we have to arrange the given expression variables in alphabetical order. So, we have written in standard form as 7a minus 9b plus 3c. Now, we shall see a to inverse. Plus 7a becomes minus 7a. Minus 9b becomes plus 9b. Plus 3c becomes minus 3c. Therefore, a to inverse is minus 7a plus 9b minus 3c. See now question number 2, write the following expressions in standard form. See the first expression, 6x plus x square minus 5. To write any expression in standard form, we have to write exponents of the variables in descending order. So let us write in standard form, x square plus 6x minus 5. See now second one. 3 minus 4a square minus 5a. In standard form it is minus 4a square minus 5a plus 3. See now third one. Minus m plus 6 plus 3m square. In standard form it is 3m square minus m plus 6. See now fourth one. c cube plus 1 plus c plus 2c square. So it is in standard form c cube plus 2c square plus c plus 1. See now fifth one q minus p square. In standard form it is minus p square plus q. See now question number 3. Add the following algebraic expressions using both horizontal and vertical method. Did you get the same answer with both the methods? Verify. See the first one 2x square minus 6x plus 3. 4x square plus 9x plus 5. Let us see first horizontal method. 2x square minus 6x plus 3 plus of 4x square plus 9x plus 5. Now rearranging the like terms. 2x square plus 4x square plus of minus 6 plus 9x plus of 5 plus 3. That equals to 2x square plus 4x square is 6x square Minus 6x plus 9x. Both are having opposite sign. We have to do subtraction. So 9x minus 6x is 3x. So write down 6x square plus 3x plus 5 plus 3 is 8. So the answer is 6x square plus 3x plus 8. Now let us solve the sum in vertical method. In vertical method first we have to write the given expressions in standard form and like terms must come in the same column. Then after we have to do addition. So we have entered the given expressions. 2x square minus 6x plus 3. 4x square plus 9x plus 5. Now let us do the addition. 2x square plus 4x square that is 6x square. 9x minus 6x that is plus 3x. 3 plus 5, 8. So the answer is 6x square plus 3x plus 8. In both the methods, we got the same answer. See now second one. 
a square plus 6ab plus 8 minus 3a square minus ab minus 2. First we shall see horizontal method. a square plus 6ab plus 8 plus of minus 3a square minus ab minus 2. Rearranging the like terms, a square minus 3a square plus of 6ab minus ab plus of 8 minus 2. That equals to, here a square minus 3a square means, both are having opposite sign, we have to do subtraction. Here, 3a square is greater than a square, so we must keep its sign, that is minus sign. Now we shall do subtraction, 3a square minus a square, that is 2a square. So the answer is here minus 2a square, 6ab minus ab is 5ab plus 8 minus 2 is 6. So the answer is minus 2a square plus 5ab plus 6. Let us see now vertical method. a square plus 6ab plus 8 minus 3a square minus ab minus 2. See here a square minus 3a square both are having opposite sign we have to do subtraction. Keep minus sign, 3a square minus a square is 2a square. So the answer is minus 2a square plus 6ab minus ab. Both are having opposite sign, we have to do subtraction. 6ab minus ab is 5ab. Next one, 8 minus 2. Here also both are having opposite sign. We have to do subtraction. 8 minus 2, that is 6. So the answer is minus 2a square plus 5ab plus 6. In both the methods, we got the same answer. See now third one, minus p square plus 2p minus 10, 4 minus 5p minus 2p square. Let us see horizontal method, minus p square plus 2p minus 10. Second expression we have written in standard form, that is minus 2p square minus 5p plus 4. Rearranging the like terms, minus p square minus 2p square plus of 2p minus 5p plus of minus 10 plus 4, that equals to here minus p square minus 2p square both are having same sign. So we shall do addition. Keep here minus and add p square plus 2p square. It becomes 3p square. So the answer is here minus 3p square. See the next one 2p minus 5p. Here both are having opposite sign. Then we have to do subtraction. Here 5p is greatest. Its sign is minus. So keep here minus sign. Then after we have to do subtraction. So 5p minus 2p it is 3p. So the answer is here minus 3p. Next one minus 10 plus 4. Both are having opposite sign. We have to do subtraction. Here 10 is greatest its sign is minus. So keep here minus sign. Then after do the subtraction 10 minus 4 6. So the answer is here minus 6. Therefore final answer is minus 3p square minus 3p minus 6. See now vertical method minus p square plus 2p minus 10. Second expression in standard form minus 2p square minus 5p plus 4. Now let us do the sum. Here minus p square minus 2p square both are having same sign. So keep minus sign. Then after do addition p square plus 2p square it is 3p square. Next plus 2p minus 5p both are having opposite sign. We have to do subtraction. 5p is greatest. It's a sign minus. So keep here minus sign. Now do subtraction. 5p minus 2p it is 3p. Next one, minus 10 plus 4. Both are having opposite sign, we have to do subtraction. Here 10 is greatest, its sign is minus, so keep here minus sign. Then after we have to do subtraction, 10 minus 4, 6. So the final answer is minus 3p square minus 3p minus 6. In both the methods, we got same answer. Hope you have liked this video. If you like this video, please like, share to your friends and subscribe to our channel. Thank you for watching.